This video is about electroscopes. In this video you will learn what an electroscope is, its construction and its working. First of all for those who don't know what electroscope is, electroscope is a very simple device used to detect the presence of charge on any body. The most common form of electroscope used in exper experimentation is gold leaf electroscope. In this video I will explain you the construction and working of the gold leaf electroscope. Construction of the gold leaf electroscope. Gold leaf electroscope consists of a metal rod and I will draw along with the explanation the schematic for the electroscope. It consists of a metal rod. This is the metal rod which is fitted in an insulating box this is an insulating box inside which it is fitted my drawing is not that good bear with me this is the metal rod and this is the insulating box in which the metal rod is fixed it is fixed it is passed through a hole in the box and fixed in the place with some adhesive and this insulating box has windows with glasses so that we can view what is happening inside the box these are the windows in the with glasses in this insulating metal box the metal rod has a metal knob at its top metal knob at its top and two gold leaves attached to its bottom end these are the two gold leaves attached to the bottom end of the metallic rod due to these gold leaves we call it gold leaf electroscope we call it not golf we call it gold leaf electroscope this is the construction of the gold leaf electroscope now uh, you want to know how it works it's working now let's take up its working how this electroscope works electroscope is used to detect presence of charge so we want to detect that whether a body has charge or not so the body to be detected is brought closer and touched to the metal knob of the electroscope the body let's say this is the this is a rod having we want to know whether it has some charge or not we touch it to the metal knob of the electroscope and if this body has any charge that will flow through the metal rod on to the gold leaves let's f let us say for example this body has a has positive is positively charged this positive charge will flow through the metal rod on to the gold leaves now the gold leaves will have positive charge and both the gold leaves will have same charge because only the positive charge is coming from the body gold leaves have same charge and in the last video you have learned that bodies having same similar charges repel each other so now these gold leaves having similar charges will repel and diverge and more the charge they will diverge due to the presence of charge more the charge more will be the divergence and uh, if I have taken the example of positive charge that body is positively charged but even if the body is negatively charged then also the leaves will diverge because positive the negative charge will flow through the metal rod and both the leaves will acquire acquire negative charge and in this case also both the leaves have similar charges in this case both negative and leaves repel each other so 
they will again diverge whether the charge is positive or negative leaves will repel each other so we cannot say whether the charge is positive or negative we can judge that body is charged it is it positive or negative we cannot say but we can say that body is charged and we can compare the amount of charge between uh, bodies if the divergence is more charge will be more more divergence means more charge so in this video you learned what an electroscope is its construction its working in the next video i will show you how to make a gold leaf electroscope and not actually gold leaves we will using aluminium leaves to make in that sort of electroscope at your own